Uh, well, a few things. Man, did I ever get a... Um, oh, here. Say hello to Leo quickly. Hello, puss. Oh, he's just getting snuggly. Um, well, a few things. I got a shot of humility due to the fact I haven't um, really paid... Oh, you know the irony is? I was like, oh, I want to go and do like a little special essay on uh, Svetozar Borevich and find out if he's the... Um, you know, if he truly is, should be called the Lion of the Asanzo and blah, blah, blah. Uh, it's because I've been reading the short history of uh, the short, um, a short, uh, a short guide to writing about history. Anyways, and they were like talking, anyways, blah, blah, blah. And um, oh, son of a bee, man. Sorry, I'm getting sidetracked. Anyways, the, the irony is I was starting to look at this and... Um, thinking about the Berevich dictum, and I was like, oh my God, I can't even remember it. That's how bad it is. All I remember is, uh, let's see a few things. Uh, never attack unless it is to regain um, uh, a lost position and at attack immediately uh, before the enemy can secure that position. Those are two and three. And I think the first one is... Uh, um, uh, Hold the territory you have at whatever cost or something like that. Anyways, I'm just going to show you, uh, you know what? I'm starting to clue, well, like I shouldn't say clue in because I haven't played, barely played any World War II games or ba barely anything. Um, you know, I always hear people talking or like, oh, that's like about World War I. You can see the difference and so on and so forth. And I know I can see it already happening, well, especially when I start getting after my version of the um, um uh, the December truce and the, um, uh, the big adjustment when I start, you know, um, converting. Uh, anyways, I get into January proper, um, 1915. Um, it's going to be like a lot of trench warfare type stuff. And I, I'm going to have to adjust my head around that type of thing. Yeah, it's going to be like a big thing of like, anyways, uh, there's going to be other stuff I love about it. I'm not a combat happy person anyway. So it's, it's okay. I get off on the other stuff. I get off on this stuff. Like trying to figure out all these crazy ass problems of trying to bring the troops to places. I haven't even done anything yet for the Germans. And they've already wasted five, well, you know, my version, wasted five of 12 um, uh, of their rail capacity for crying out loud. And then, well, the Austro-Hungarians are actually, in, and ironically, in a better sh spot due to the fact they've got seven, but they've only used one. Um and I'm going to be doing them first. I wanted to do them first anyways. Um, I'm not saying they've got an easier task, but part of the Katowice, uh Conference Agreement, um, like it's legally binding, is as soon as those, uh, at least one double railway was um, um, opened up uh, in the Tritown area, um, the Germans uh, had to send 10 supply points over. Um, I was thinking about doing two fives, uh, but I'm like, screw that. Uh, that, um, I don't know. If, yeah, it still would. It would eat up two rail, uh, capacity cause they are separate bits. So, and I would like, yeah, tough Austria. You'll have to deal with it yourself of how to figure it out. But, um, what I'm saying is, so all I've got a lot of festoon divisions and a lot of things to move around here. In other words, it's not going to happen right away. Um, yep. The Germans have got a ton of <clears throat> excuse me, a ton of strength points and a ton of supply points sitting around here. Um, but it's going to take time still to get things all in place. It's kind of like, um, I still have to remind myself, this is almost like getting into chess, uh, chessboard land. Um, on a side note, I do have to, I love this flipping table to bits. I've told you that a ton of times. Love it. But you see the wobble? I have to be careful because it's not actually hard connected to the legs. It's just kind of like in pegs or something. And I'm just get a bit worried it's going to nail that TV the way I am. Anyways, uh, I'll nail it. And with my noise canceling headphones, I may not find out right away, which would suck either way. I mean, finding out right away would suck and finding out later on, it would suck as well. But in other words, I have to be uh, figure out, you know, be careful. Um, yeah, it's going to still take me ages to figure out how to like wrap my head around, uh, maybe it never will, uh, around, uh, you know, this uh, aspect of World War One warfare of, you know, but in a weird way, just like I've said, it just feels very chess-like in a, 
I don't know. But uh, we'll see. Like the Russians, in some ways, I'm like, you know what? Just hold on, man. Hold on. I know I get so depressed sometimes, though. I'm, I'm, I, I stare down here. I'm just like, it's over for them. It's over. Like, calm down, man. It's not. Uh, you, there's still a lot of things to do. It's just because, like, every time you see, you know, I, I said, like I told you, I'll go through the whole counters and the Alberto markers. But if you see here, like, there's nothing written. Well, that's a wrong one. I shouldn't have picked that because it's an engineering one. But here, there's nothing. There's no cavalry unit. Nothing. Nothing specifying that there's a non in non-combat unit there that's like specifically let's say a cavalry um so i know for example that's a um oh, but, uh, my entering mike would know how to say it uh, a people's militia unit there and which means uh and why i don't have a strength point marker there like those guys on the bottom uh left like five two like i said i'll do a little thingamajig um that is a people's militia unit and their strength points, which is only one, is uh, only used for counter uh, counter attacking. So they're not they're of no use to me um, attacking wise. So that's why I don't put them down. But then I can move them around all over the place. It's just um, you know I still and also would have to still um, supply them for attack. It's not like um, free whatever. It's not like a the Ottoman uh, type of stuff. If you go and take a look at their uh, counter attacks, I think they have. Um, uh, you don't have to supply them for the counterattacks, which is totally cool. But anyways, there's a lot of stuff to do here. Um, but boy, oh boy. Yeah. Okay, that's it. Uh -huh. Unfortunately, I have to go and do like, you know, as in, as you know, um, focus on reality. Okay, see you later. Bye.